Hey lovelies, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all happy and healthy. I really do hope that this is not too loud. Anyway, in today's video, we are going to be doing a bit of a cleanup video of my desk area. As you can tell, it's quite messy, uh, even like the junk on the floor here. It's, it's just not the way I like it and I, I really don't like coming into this space. Anyway, that's what our video is about today. It's going to be a nice desk cleanup and cleaning up all of the stuff that I use. If that interests you and you would like to see it, be sure to hit that subscribe button down below and we'll get straight into the video. Okay, so I was trying to figure out what to do for today's video and then I thought, you know what, I could really clean up this mess. It's absolutely disgusting. I don't like working in a space like this. I don't even like doing crafty stuff in a space like this. In the end, I actually grab my trolley. Let's be honest now. I grab my trolley and I actually put it in the dining room area and then put it on the table. Anyway, I wanted to kind of go through a bunch of stuff. As you can see, I've got the tripod thing over there. I've got the trolley here. It probably does need a little bit of a tidy. I mean, it is quite neat still, but things need to be put away. I have this Lego box over here that I am currently still trying to find pieces for. There's a lot missing apparently. Anyway, uh, so that's got to go. Uh, we've got a printer <laughs> underneath the table here. I was using it as a footstool, <laughs> but I'm not going to do that anymore. That's got to go. All that's got to be cleaned up. That has to go back into the trolley. I've got to write letters back to my friends and also my daughter. Oh, I'm trying to make sure it focuses on this stuff. Uh, you know, and like boxes that I've taken stuff out of and bought things from. Um, uh, over here, I feel like I probably should, you know, put this stuff away or at least tidy it up because I just, I don't know, I really don't like it. But I do have all my other stuff here. I do like my crystals and stuff all there. I do like that there with my Harry Potter thing, uh, wand as well. I'll show you a quick, nice close up. This is the Elder Wand and I absolutely love it. And of course I found this statue that looked a lot like Hedwig and I just had to have it. Anyway, enough about the crystals and the Harry Potter. <laughs> Uh, but oh, I bumped into another chair. Uh, there's a lot of stuff. I'll oh, look to be honest. It's very messy over my husband's side, but this is the area he has his anime and whatever else. Um, it is very tight in this room. Let's be honest. It's a very small room for an office. Um, honestly, it's a bedroom. I don't even see a bed fitting in this room to be honest, but we've made it into an office. This is our area. This side is mine, that side is hubby's, uh, but yeah, let's just get straight in. I'll stop talking and just start cleaning up what is here. <laughs> All right, let's get into it.
there we have it lovelies that is the desk set up now I'm not gonna lie I'm absolutely loving it I am so glad I decided to put that thing uh, where underneath the monitor I don't know I, I love the fact that it's just propped it up a little bit more and I love the fact that I can put my little um, what do you call it a uh, keyboard underneath I think it is absolutely fantastic now for those that are actually wondering why don't I use these drawers now it is because this desk is absolutely very very old uh, and I don't exactly want to have a desk that's going to have the drawers anymore because the desk that I did have before I moved it had no drawers whatsoever and it's just sitting in our bedroom at the moment uh, until we can replace uh, basically the desk for our TV to sit on in our bedroom. So what I'm doing is I'm creating a space where I do not need drawers whatsoever and that way uh, when I do finally move my new desk in here I'm not going to be going oh my god I have no desk drawer space things and I can't put anything anywhere and that's the whole reason why I've done it that way. So yes, uh, do not use them at all and everything else is kind of just put away neatly. As you can tell, it looks so much better. I haven't vacuumed or anything, so just excuse the dust and everything. Kept that the same. There was nothing really I could change over there, but as you can see, everything is absolutely amazing. Trolley, still the same. I just neatened it up a little bit in there. Honestly, there was not much to neaten up. I chucked all the spare paper down in here only because I don't have anywhere else to put it and that's the neatest I can do right now and then chucked uh, a bunch of other things in there. Then I've got my little pink crate here. This is mainly to keep me up keep me up to date and in track of my pen pal letters I I love doing these I think they're amazing and it gets my my creativity out and that's what I love about it so much so that's why that's kind of there it kind of reminds me that I need to get them done or finished and uh, to then f finally send them off and of course I've got a couple of things that I have in here you know just to add for the pen pals as well uh, whenever it you know I decide to put it in there and if it can fit uh, but I also decided to keep my main planner here which is obviously this one at the moment I just used the one planner I decided to put the notepad up the top here I did have those up here originally didn't like it I liked it where it was just you know kept to a minimal look and simplicity is such a good thing uh, chucked those in there because I don't exactly know where else to put them this is just so this little drawer space here is honestly not a nest like it's not used a lot let's be honest I do pull these out every now and then made these little cards ages ago uh, as you can tell because of the old name Bluey's Creations um, yeah, they're just little cards and of course in here I'm waiting to get to a thousand subscribers so I can do a giveaway and I'm slowly picking up a few things and adding a little giveaway thing together. Uh, then this is just a drawer space for a bunch of random other things. Like I said, this is honestly not going to be used very much and if I don't use pretty much any of it, I'll probably get rid of it anyway. Then we'll move over to here. As you can tell, I can put my keyboard under there out the way when I have this beautiful blossom desk what is it mouse pad it's a huge mouse pad let's be honest but anyway it's pretty then we have all the sticky notes in here that you know one is for all the paper side ones uh, and then the transparent ones that's the neatest I can get it but it'll work for now then I have over this side I tried to make it as neat as possible but this is all the main pens that I can use and ones that I don't exactly keep in my planner. This is what I use non-stop, so that's why they're there and it's very simple. That's all in there. And then, of course, my beautiful computer that my husband made for me. I am so loving the lights in there. I don't know if the camera will pick it up, but I love the crystals. They just look so freaking awesome. And yet, he's about to buy me a new 
graphics card. I hope I got that right. Otherwise, he's going to be very upset that I got it wrong. <laughs> he's right into it. But I think it's a graphics card and it's crystal and it's got blossom. Wait, does it have crystals? No, I don't think it has crystals. But it's got blossoms on it, which will match my theme. I freaking love it. <laughs> That's how much I love this setup. But I hope you all enjoyed this video. I'm trying to back up without falling over. But yes, I hope you all enjoyed this video with the desk setup and cleanup area. I think everything looks absolutely amazing right now. It looks so much better than what it was before. It was so chaotic and it just had to change and I'm so in love with it right now. I love, love, love this look. Uh, let me know in the comments below of whether you have a simple setup like this as well and do you get overwhelmed with too much clutter in your space? I'd love to know. Thank you for taking the time out of your day in watching these videos. I really do appreciate it and don't forget to be positive and give love. Bye!